Hello, our friends, Evolutionary Energy Arts family. Hello there. Welcome back. So there is so much going on, guys. Um, I think I'm going to split this up into little bits because, or smaller bits, because there's just so much going on right now to cover. Let's focus on this because this is a developing story that may end up drowning out the other ones or it might fizz into just another typical, well, it's already the most serious IT outage in the world. Uh, they say, so maybe not so typical, government holds emergency COBRA meeting after Microsoft meltdown sparks global chaos, planes and trains grounded, GPs in mayhem, shops closed, football tickets canceled, TV channels offline. Uh, yeah, you know, it's, this almost sounds like the IT end of the world as we know it. We'll see. We'll see. So this is all talking about uh, over in, in Britain, again, uh, this has, has really disrupted life. It's already, um, you know, afternoon over there. It's early morning here in, in the U.S. And everywhere around the world, they're feeling the, um, the, the blow to this. And, and the first word that hits me is Microsoft, right? So, I mean, when we, again, are looking at Microsoft, we're looking at Gil Bates, you know, that ultimately was at the source. So, you know, again, you start thinking big agendas when you think of Microsoft and Gil Bates. Cybersecurity company CrowdStrike has admitted to being responsible for the error that hit Microsoft 365 apps. An operating system set of fixes has been deployed. The American fir firm said it was caused by a defect found in a single content update <clears throat> and assisted the issue was not a security incident or a cyber attack. Windows is the most used operating system in the world. So obviously this is going to be hitting all over. I was looking at the take of this from RT um, from the Russian perspective as well. So they're saying again, problems so far have been reported in Australia, New Zealand, India, Japan, of course, the UK and the US as well. Uh, Dubai International Airport says it's returned to normal operations after some of its check in procedures was affected by the global outage. About 30% of McDonald's outlets in Japan have been forced to suspend operations. Well, see, there's some good news. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Russia's Ministry of Digital Development said. The Microsoft outage was further proof that the country needs to continue to wean itself off of foreign software, especially when it comes to critical infrastructure. Kremlin's IT systems have not been affected by the Microsoft outage. Uh, flight and railway authorities in Russia also confirmed their operations continue unimpeded. Israel's health ministry said a, a widespread wor worldwide malfunction and computer service has affected its hospitals and other service so you could see how this split is and you know BRICS is is, is um, benefiting in many ways uh, right now from all the chaos in the West and again we've we've gone so deep into um, how how the power structure works from our perspective looking at it so if you, you're flying today, uh, American Airlines, United Delta, they've implemented a global ground stop on all flights due to the current significant Microsoft outage that is occurring. And as you see, you know, everywhere, Peter from Sweden's talking about, everybody's talking about this. So it is curious too, because, you know, as we know, everything always gets game played, uh, role played. They talk about these things that could happen. And this is, you know, Klaus saying, look, this is going to happen. It's going to happen. And everything's going to come to a complete stop. Now, we, we personally have had multiple power outages uh, in the last uh, several days. Very disruptive. Each time it was right when I was uploading a video. Yeah. And so it's like, wow, that's interesting. Right when I'm uploading, you know, boom, the power goes out. And, you know, thankfully it, it wasn't for too long a period of time. But, yeah, you know, our inside of our house rapidly into the well into the 90s. And I think about people that, you know, well, maybe maybe I 
you know, can't say I'm not old anymore, you know, chronologically, but I feel like I could handle things from a physical standpoint better than a lot of people with compromised systems. And yeah, if, if we do end up with major power outages, which um, we, we do follow the Polish psychic, we're going to have an update from him to um, there's going to be a, a Patreon a exclusive going up um, right after this one it, with uh, some stuff that's um, a little harsh, you know, as well as, um, you know, just the reality of, of what's what's coming. At the same time, there are changes in, in consciousness that are advancing so quickly, and there's this awakening going on. And, and yeah, I do think that uh, the elites are terrified of letting uh, go of control of planet Earth. Yet I think they realize uh, that they, they're going to have to. They're not going to have a monopoly. They're already starting to lose the monopoly side of things as people wake up. But we still got to wake up others so that people don't <laughs> just go ahead and start to uh, foment and manifest the plans of, of the dark cabal that runs this show or has run this show. Because remember, it's divide and conquer. That's the ultimate thing, divide and conquer. As soon as we start to unite, it's, it's, it's sayonara. It's going to be all over. And yet there are those that are unfortunately so deep into the system and you know, it's, it, it's, it's, it's again uh, corrupted by the system that corruption takes hold and you know they utilize that to their advantage so you know again uh you know they the, the few they talked all about this they t and, and not that this is necessarily that time it feels like it's going to be something we're going to have to get used to and this is something i think cindy's gotten i think other people have gotten too that you're going to start to see these outages that happen and we've always thought this is part of the plan they, they're going to start to turn up the discomfort factor mm -hmm. well i've always kind of seen a, a bumpy landing you know to to a world changed and through that bumpy landing i think that's where the uh the controllers will lose control because this is where people are gonna find out how resourceful they really are they're gonna figure out wow i can do this and 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 i can accomplish this and i don't need the system um but you know we need to reach people where they're at so it's it's not a, about not covering the news it's more about hollering to a crowd of people saying hey guys there's something come check this out over here we can do something different we don't have to do it that way we can do it a different way and that's where we're that's what we're trying to do there was event 201 that happened back uh in october of 2019 right before the plague upon the land came out and now there's also another uh similar event that's going to be taking place this October so we see the patterns it's beyond obvious for a lot of people right now what's going on uh, lots of people taking note of um, everything that was going on obviously with the whole 45 situation and you know we'll get into more details on that uh, as well this is this is really uh, go time to, to say the least. We're, we're we're in the second half of 2024, and we remember those narratives and forecasts. I still have this forecast sitting right here. It's archived from the DEA GEL people that we feel was a threat from the system uh, to everybody that's not in the system of what they would do if they don't get their way. You know, but humanity is waking up and we do have assistance from other um, beings that have technology that, again, makes the control system quiver. As you see, this is a big, big outage. A lot more going on. <clears throat> Just wanted to, to let you guys know about this situation. Uh, we're going to put this one up on Evolutionary and then we're going to have a Patreon exclusive Again, uh, we, we feel like we need to give back to those that, that are supporting us because they literally are supporting us. Uh, and yet we want to share with as many as possible all that 
we know and and we we try to do that on a daily basis as well but while we're still in the system uh it still takes uh you know it, unfortunately it still takes that that thing which the power structure covets and creates out of thin air to keep things going so again guys thanks for being part of this family be as prepared as you can be i, I think absolutely this you know the second part of 2024 it is probably going to be in many ways the most exciting roller coaster ride you've ever been on. Oh, and by the way, somebody said they figured out what happened with this outage. It was just just this little guy. That was it. He's a smart one. He's a good one. These these guys are adorable. Indeed, I want to. Okay, we could work on that. <laughs> Source bless and namaste. Namaste. <laughs>